this young new rapper. Little tea bag. Wait, like, wait, wait I'm, I'm sorry, what? Like, like the tea you drink. He, just, he likes tea. Mm. Are you sure about that? Yeah, they call him Teasy for short. Yeah. But you know what tea bagging is, right? Girl, he's not drinking tea. He likes it with honey. Yeah. He likes his balls in your mouth. Come on, come on. <laughs> oh, yeah, right. Okay. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what? The ghost. Oh, I'm gonna smoke this. Oh, no, 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 no. Get that out of my face! Wait. Goodness okay, sake, just put that back. Dating a rapper in his car, smoking his weed. He's got a gun. Well, maybe I should start oh, dating Jesus. guys my own age. Oh, yeah. No, I don't really like smoking weed that much, anyways. Yeah. Oh well. Yeah. What is that? What? It's just a little crack. It's fine. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> she is Hi. crazy. Free! So Jesus! Oh, oh my, god. my god! Is that real? Yes, that's that not back. funny! That is not funny. This is not it's training not day! It's fine. My god. Oh my god. God, what is going on? Welcome, oh. welcome to the right. party. Oh, you know what I wish we had right now? Yeah. Some snacks. Oh my, wait. Remember that one time when we pranked? Alpha Sigma Phi. <laughs> <laughs> this frat, right, filled with these little bratty, spoiled boys complaining about how things were so much better back in the day when men were in charge of everything mm -hmm. and women were in the kitchen, right? So we decided to show them what it would be like if men ruled again. Yep. So we uh -huh. made the entire frat <laughs> brownies. And these yes, idiots we were so excited. Only thing is, they didn't know about our secret ingredient. <laughs> what was it? Our shit. <laughs> <laughs> they actually ate your shit. They loved every crumb of it. Yes, I will. I, I will say that I am genuinely a good cook when I want to be. That's what they get for an, electing a reality star. Two, Two terms. terms. Like they shouldn't be protesting Michelle. If anything, they should be protesting Trump for ruining everything <laughs> for men. Like what a jackass. I kind of feel like we should be thanking him for just fucking it up so badly. When I walk into Starbucks, I can't even enjoy my pumpkin spice latte anymore because every time I go to order it, I think about that whipped cream on top and that crazy little caramel. No. And I just can't even stomach Girl, it you anymore. Are too Cheers to being women. Okay. <laughs> Wait. Ten <laughs> Crack Commandments, Biggie Smalls, remember that one? Mm -hmm. Biggie, Biggie, Biggie. Can't you see? Sometimes your words just hypnotize me. <laughs> and I just love your flashy ways. What? Guess that's why they broke and you're so paid. are really starting to accept me now. And I get it, I totally get it. They've got this crazy bond from college, you know, like nothing brings two women closer together than college. You probably got drunk, made out in the bathroom a couple times, like you were just experimenting, or a little confused, you know, maybe motorboated each other every now and then. I get that, we'll never have that bond. But how do I get a text? How do I get an invite? You know, I really wouldn't mind getting a text every now and then that was like, yeah, great pie chart today, Rebecca. Like, I wanna show you my new power pants suit I bought. Like, yeah, girl. Show me that power pants suit. Send me a Snapchat. Tell me about my bar graph. Like I spent 25 minutes making it. I even color coordinated it for you. Tell me anything, anything. Just let me be a part of this tiny little circle. Their friend circle is like a virgin asshole. Like it is this big around and I can't seem to find a way in. Yes, I know that sounds very creepy and predatorial. No, I do not care. Like any action's better than none.
Well, hey, I want to welcome, uh, I guess, all two or three of you out tonight. But I guess if any more people were here, I'd have to be back working. I'm struggling in this new environment. As soon as the ladies got on top, my job cut my hours and my time, which is crazy because I slept with Ashley to get the job in the first place. No, nothing, no. I can tell you this, I am uh, dating even though it's tough in this environment. I met another beautiful girl. She really made me believe we were gonna be together and I'm embarrassed to say that she ended up pregnant. She has the baby in some kind of way. She says it wasn't hers. How does that happen? Okay, ladies and gentlemen, ladies, thank you for your time. Uh, my name is Gerard. I'll be here all week until Ashley cuts my hours some more. Thank you. Totally. <laughs> All right, we've got the Mia Tasha special. Mm, oh. No one makes a Mia Tasha like you. Because no one else knows what's in it, not even you. True, and I think I like it better that way. Mm. Mm -hmm. It's really sad because it's very clear that they have a drinking problem and like a drug problem too. You know, like the booger sugar. It's like cocaine. And the reason I know this is because, you know, my old college roommate, Allie, kind of had the same problem. We just kind of nicknamed her Alfie and she loved it. She thought it was funny, you know. I wonder what she's doing though. I should probably call her, right? Mm. Well, what do we have here? Something fun? Hey, cutie, what's your name? You want a Mia Tasha? <laughs> Excuse me? Oh, it's a drink. Don't be so uptight. So, it's a dilf like you doing drinking alone on a Friday night. Dilf? Mm-hmm. That would be a dad I'd like ah, to- Ah, don't scare him. And they scare men everywhere they go. And it is just so far past empowerment now. It is like, it's like, like, evil empowerment, you know? Actually, uh, I'd just like to spend a little time by myself right now, thank you. Well, why don't I buy you an adult beverage and then we can decide if that's what you really want. Actually, I can pay for my own drink, thanks. Oh, oh, is that right, independent man? I don't need nobody buying his drink. So your wife must have a good job then. I don't need any woman to provide anything for me. And I also don't need your eyes looming over my physique. Ew. Here we go. Buzz skills. I can't stand it. I'm independent. <laughs> Cheers to that. I can buy my own drinks. Mm -hmm. <laughs> With my mom's money. <laughs> Come on. I use my EBT card. <laughs> <laughs> it's scary. I'm older than I'm scared. Rebecca! Yes, mama, I'm doing a vlog. She does this all the time. You know, this right here, this is because of her. Because she constantly interrupts me and she knows that I'm trying to work and she knows I've got millions of fans that are depending on me to deliver news about my life and I can't do that successfully when she keeps interrupting me all the time, every day, constantly. My therapist, Dr. Scholl, says I have issues because I can never form a complete thought without her interrupting me and it's giving me codependency issues. You're right, Sandra. I'm sorry.